So I like to think of it as like a reciprocating dingle arm. The arm is really loose. It's just kind of hanging from the shoulder and just swinging back and forth. Feel where you can accelerate the disc with gravity. Let the shoulder hang. So the reciprocating dingle arm with the hammer. Just like trying to swing it. And you can feel where you can pow. Use gravity. Same thing with the forehand. Back and forth. So with the hammer, if I was to want to hammer through this box or put a nail through it, I've got the box at least a foot past my shoulder. And I should feel like from the reach back, like I'm just going to be hitting the, the hammer. Or the, I feel like I'm just hitting the nail plowing through that box out there with a lot of force. So you're really letting go of the momentum and you're going to grip harder so it, so it doesn't fly away but if you throw fast enough there's a point where you can't hold on any longer you create so much momentum on the hammer or on the disc that it's going to fly out there. So that's how much force you're putting on it or momentum. And that's why you're pulling this heavy door frame because that's how much drag there's going to be or momentum that you're pulling and swinging and hammering out there throwing out there. So talking about weight shift, you've got the world under your feet and weight is how much force you're putting into the ground. So it's kind of weird talking about shifting your weight during a throw because you really don't want to be thinking about where is your weight it's easier to think about staying balanced over the ground on either leg. Uh, you're always dynamically balanced. So when you go to reach back, you're actually going to have more weight on the front foot to start moving 
you're going to have more weight to start on the front foot and you're going to swing back and your weight moves with it. And then the start and the start you're just settling your weight back into the front. So just going back and forth, front heel will lift off the ground as my, my hip moves it back. It's just getting pulled up from the swing. The first thing is I'm moving back this way. I'm hitting the heel before I feel the disc pointing to keep going that way. You should feel the heel hit before you feel the, the whip. Heel whip. Toss plant. Gotta be kind of loose. Put the elbow lead and whip it out there. 